Once you clean all the surface, remove the two bolts, 13 millimeter, that hold the caliber using 15 as a counter hold. Next step is to remove the electric motor from the caliper and there is two 30 Torx bolts. You have to clean them well before undoing them. Now detach the motor. Now Volvo says that if you remove the motor they want you to replace these two bolts and the seal with the part number at the bottom. I don't have it, so I'm gonna just reuse it. If you want, you can order by using the part number. Now, to compress the piston, you need to screw over here 40 Torx counterclockwise I mean clockwise do it until it stops Now when you compress 
the piston you want to watch you want to watch your brake fluid level because it might go over watch your brake fluid level next step is to put the motor back on If you want to replace the disc brake, you need to remove the bracket.
one side is complete not not hard at all now it's time to do the other side The other side is done, just completed all the job, brand new brakes at the rear, that's all the old stuff, now the worst was the driver's side, the most thin one. And the driver's side inside was the worst. And this is passenger side. All done. Now it's time to readjust the electronic parking brake. And to do that, there is instructions. You need to start the car. And you want to press the brake until it becomes firm. Now, three times you want to apply the handbrake. Actually, you need to press the brake. It's on to release. That was one. That was two. And three. All done. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.